Hey everyone, welcome back to another new video. I hope you all are fit and fine. So today I'm going to fix this motherboard and this is a HP Lightbook 840 G5 laptop motherboard. And this motherboard problem is says turn on with no display, black screen. And uh, now I will try to fix this motherboard. So let's try to fix it. Okay, uh, this is a motherboard part number. So let me show you the problem first. As soon as I connect DC power supply to this motherboard, it's turned on with low amps. As you can see, it's taking low amps. That means uh, all the voltage is present on this motherboard except the CPU core voltage. So let me show you. I don't need to check another any voltage but uh, I just want to show you so I set my multimeter in DC mode and let's check from 13 volt uh, as you can see 12 volt which is present let's check this 5 volt also present secondary both are present let's check this 3.3 .3 volt this also good 1 volt is also okay 3.3 secondary this also okay 1.8 is present 1.5 okay 1 volt okay here also okay this also okay but we have no CPU core voltage so let's check the evidence this coil it's a uh, 4.6 good it's okay so let's check these voltages 1.8 1.8 here also okay so now i will <coughs> check this uh, one point one one volt uh, secondary this both and uh, i will check this uh, ram voltage this also secondary voltage so at first let's check here okay let's check under my microscope so we can see easily we have one volt here also okay. Let's check this one. One point two. One point two. But uh, as you can see, there is no gate voltage. That one point two is present. But there is no gate voltage. And as you can see, some corrosion here, liquid damage. So this line is coming from here, here to here. So we have no great voltage. Sometimes it's present below 13 or 11 volt. Here should be present 11 volt. So let's check this first. Okay, this line is broken here. Let's make this line first with jumper wire.
Okay, mine is done. Let's plug in again. Here's not turning on. Still not get all this. Okay, let's remove this switch from here. <coughs> check this get voltage is okay now as you can see we have get voltage 11 volt or uh, 11.82 this voltage is present now so first i will change on a volt let's see what happened Okay, replace is done. Let's plug in again. And as you can see, it's taking 0 0.4 or something. That means our core voltage is present now. So let's check this voltage again. And we have 1.2, get also 11. Check this core voltage on this coil, and we have a core voltage now. So now I will uh, check displays if they are not. Spot 10. 
need to wait for a few seconds because it will, it will uh, restart to one or two times. Okay, it's a restart. Come on. Okay, so we have HP logo. It was very easy to fix. So I hope you all are enjoyed this video. If you like this video, so please hit the subscribe button. Press the bell icon if you already subscribed my channel. Thank you so much. See you in the next video. Until then, stay well. Bye-bye.